As president of K-State's club tennis team, Matt Berniking has the chance to meet and spend time with a unique group of people every week. Just the people here. Uh, we have a really good group of people. That's always fun. Makes it fun to go to. I wouldn't want to do this and like organize all of this all the time if the people weren't so fun to be around. The club team had its most successful year since starting at Kansas State, making its first Nationals appearance in Phoenix, Arizona. While you do not need to be a college student to attend practices, you do need to be one to be able to compete in tournaments. The tournaments are then decided by who comes to practice the most. They are, they call them USDA Tennis on Campus tournaments, so they're sponsored through the United States Tennis Association. But we go far even to, so I mean, Nationals were in Arizona this year, we even flew to it, so we get funded through the SGA to be able to go do that. Whether you're just starting out or you've been playing for years, anyone can come to practice on Monday and Wednesday nights. The team travels to tournaments in the spring from places like Iowa all the way to Arizona. Crystal Long, a senior who has played club tennis her entire time at K-State, says that her favorite part about being on the team is the tournaments that they get to compete in during the season. So it's fun to still play at that high um, level of competition and get to play other colleges. Um, and then just to challenge myself with mixed doubles and singles um, to get out of my comfort zone a little bit. It's been a lot of fun. As with any group, there are different roles and leadership positions. Amy Wagner is the vice president for the club. She does things such as helping to run practices, to booking hotels, and making travel plans for tournaments. It is a little time consuming, especially having a leadership role in it. Um, so just kind of coming out to every practice and even traveling for tournaments and things like that. When looking at this team, they may have all come from different levels of experience with tennis, but they formed friendships and skills on and off the court.